deep seek deep seek deep seek pretty much everyone in the ai world is now super pumped up about the deep seek models especially the deep seek r1 model and today in this video i'm going to show you how you can install set up and run deep seek r1 model locally on your computer that means we'll be literally hosting and running it locally on a computer without the need for a internet connection and if you're someone who is skeptical about the privacy and you don't want to send your data to the deep seek servers in china this is the video for you now without wasting further ado let's jump straight in all right so to download install and set up DeepSeek locally on our machine, we'll be using a software called LM Studio. So the first thing that you got to do is to click the first link in the description below and head over to lmstudio.ai. So this right here is the website. And LM Studio is a software that you could use to discover, download and run local LLMs or run LLMs locally on your machine. And LM Studio is available for both Windows, Mac OS and Linux. So the first thing that you got to do is to download LM Studio for your machine. So in this case, I am here using Mac OS with M-series chip. So I'll go ahead and click on download for Mac. Go ahead and download the installer and install and open it up. And again, if you want to view all the models that are available within LM Studio, you can go ahead and click on this option that says model catalog and you'll be able to find all these models. It means all these models you can download and start using it locally on your machine using LM Studio. All right, so this right here is LM Studio. So I went ahead, downloaded and installed LM Studio on my computer. And I hope you have done the same. So once you open LM Studio, you will be taken through an initial onboarding process. Now that I've already set up LM Studio already. So this is the kind of interface that you'll see. And now if you click, you will find an option that says discover. So if you click on this discover option, you will be able to find the list of all models that you could download and set up using LM Studio on your computer. And it includes DeepSeek R1 distilled models, that is Quen 7B and Llama 8B. Now these two are the different flavors of DeepSeek that you could install using LM Studio. And again, mind you, we are using a distilled version of DeepSeek, not the flagship or the original version. So as you can see, DeepSeek R1 distilled into Llama 8B and DeepSeek R1 distilled into Quen 7B. All right. And now as for the system requirements, LM Studio team recommends you have at least 16 GB of RAM. But this Mac right here, I only have 8 GB and I'm still able to use uh, DeepSeek R1 with only 8 GB of RAM. And if you click on any one of these models, you'll be able to find how much uh, size it has. For example, the DeepSeek R1 uh, Quen 7B model is 4.68 and this one right here that is uh, Llama 8B is 4.32 GB. Now all you gotta do is to select one of these models between these two and go ahead and click on it and you can click on this download option and you can start downloading the model to your computer via LM Studio. So it will take some time. So depending on your internet speed, it will take anywhere between 10 to 20 or even one hour to download the model. So once that process is done, now I'm canceling it, you should find it here. Uh, as, as you can see, we have already downloaded this uh, Quen 7B distilled R1 model and you have it in here and I can close it for now. And if I select this one, you will see an option that says use in new chat. So all I got to do is to click on this use in new chat option and it should now load the DeepSeek R1 model in here and I can start using it. And as you can see, system resource usage is RAM 4 GB and CPU 0.00 percentage. Now, as you can see, we are using LM Studio Community DeepSeek R1 Distal Quen 7B model. And if you have other models downloaded on your computer, you can go ahead and select it from here and start using the same as well. And now let's say I go ahead and click on Hi and click on Send. Now the DeepSeek R1 Distal Quen B7 model is the one that is running locally on our machine is answering our question. So as you can see, hello, how can I assist you today, right? Let's say which is the tallest building in the world and I can hit enter and now DeepSeek R1 distill model and as you can see when it is thinking as it is a reasoning model when it is thinking you will find an option that says thinking and it says all right so I need to figure out which is the tallest building in the world um, where do I start well buildings can vary a lot in terms of height etc 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 and I mean every time you ask some kind of question to DeepSeek R1, it will literally think like a human, it will reason and it will talk to itself and come to a conclusion and okay, this might be what this user is looking for. So let's just go ahead and give it or maybe, it, but okay, do we have multiple options? Which one is more likely that the user has asked for and it will do all the reasoning and thinking stuff and that give us a, you know, sort of a answer. And in this case, my system resources, I only have about 8 GB of RAM and also I'm running M1. So this is pretty slow. So depending on your system configuration, the model can be a little bit slow. So as you can see, it is still thinking. And once the thinking process is done, it, sh it should show me the answer. So let's wait for it. And as you can see, the thinking process is done and it says the tallest building in the world is Burj Khalifa located in Dubai, United Arab Emirates, eight to eight meters, 163 floors, etc, etc. 
and the best part you can literally go ahead and disconnect the internet connection and it will still work for example let me quickly go ahead and turn off wi-fi in here now i don't have access to any internet i'll go ahead and open up a new thread and i can go ahead and say who is the founder of apple inc okay hit enter and now mind you i don't have any internet connection on my laptop and still the r1 model is running on my computer and it is thinking about it and yeah hum, i remember hearing the steve jobs was involved with apple now it will do a bit of reasoning itself and show us the result and wait for it all right so as you can see apple inc was founded by steve jobs steve wozniak steve jobs served as the ceo and visionary leaders of the company all right there you have it you can also find how much token it took in the right side here or the left side here. So we have 523 tokens, 229 tokens and 244 tokens. And again, you can also go ahead and upload PDF, docx or other plain text kind of documents to the model and you can go ahead and upload that model have it in its context and start conversing with the model as well so yeah this is how simple it is to install setup and run deep seek r1 model locally on your machine and even without internet access you'll be able to run it locally on your machine and you can be rest assured that all the data stays within your computer and use it without the internet connection i hope you guys found this video useful if yes make sure to subscribe and i'll see you next one